We would like to thank Reverend Monsignor and Ms. Marie Joseph, Vicar General and Vice President for releasing the second version of Process Management System. Now, we follow ahead with an automated presentation system and understand more about the project and its milestones. Implementing a process management system to achieve the goal of ODP, integrated human development in a better and professional way by addressing the need with proper analysis and clear process to empower the organization to reach the role of an agent that enables, encourages and facilitates the creation of active and committed leaders in communities who are dedicated to the cause of the uplift of the downtrodden. Our engagement with ODP Memorandum of Understanding for Software as a Service for three years was signed and the project kicked off on 7 November 2012. Our development team is working with ODP officials to implement a clear process to capture the necessary data which is very much useful for the organizational level analysis and helpful to improve the operational efficiency in a proper and structured way. Development, implementation, training, modifications are in progress which is almost in line with the committed schedule. Agile methodology for software development has been followed wherein it means having one-to-one -one interaction while building the software. Achieved milestone so far MOU was signed on 22nd October 2012. Project kicked off on 7 November 2012. Temporary hardware to host the application was deployed in January 2013. Online appraisal system was implemented in February 2013. Online content management system, the ODP website published across internet along with social media integration in April 2013. First version of PMS released on 22nd June 2013. Modules deployed are CPP, WEP, NRM, LEP, HAS and HR. To address the need of monthly meeting in a simplest way, shorter version was released in October 2013. New server hardware installed in November 2013. New version developed and accommodated in version 2 by integrating lot of analytical tools like special reports, graphs, charts, etc. which is flagged off today. Major hurdles observed across are gathering of requirement. Since the software package is new to ODP and social process is new to us, cost to spend more time in understanding, streamlining and fine tuning the process. This kept continuing like a never ending process. Designing and implementation went bit away from the schedule majorly due to dynamic nature of system and the volume of huge process. On this occasion, we would like to express our heartfelt thanks to Most Reverend Dr. Thomas Anthony Varapilli, Bishop of Mysore and the President of ODP for giving us an opportunity to work with the organization and his guidance and governance towards this project. We also thank to Reverend Monsignor J.B. Xavier former director of ODP for giving us an opportunity to work with ODP and his guidance and governance towards this project. Now, we take this opportunity to express our gratitude towards Reverend Father Stanley D. Almeda, Executive Director, come Secretary of Organization for the Development of People for giving us an opportunity. He is consistently encouraging us with his vision and guiding us towards implementing a clear and transparent process for the organization. His working experience especially in the grassroots level in the organization 
helped us to learn a totally new domain, the NGO and developed a project which is getting a wide acceptance across ODP. We also thank all governing body members for guiding and supporting us throughout the tenure of the project. Vice President Reverend Monsignor and Ms. Marie Joseph Vicar General. Vice President Reverend Monsignor Desmond Rebello Episcopal Vicar. Founder Director Reverend Dr. Thomas Beckett de Souza, Secretary of Mysore Diocese Educational Society. Reverend Father Vincent Fernandez, Parish Priest Marwali. Reverend Father John Sikvara, Financial Administrator. Reverend Father William Kelly, Parish Priest. Mr. Gerald Castellino, Advocate. Sister Jessie de Souza, Social Worker. Mrs. Loretta Pinto, Industrialist. Now, we take this opportunity to thank the managing forces behind this project. Mrs. Geeta Mitra, who supported throughout to implement and track the process in the system. And Mr. Varaprasad for extending support by sharing ideas, bettering the vision of the director to make a better and better process and its implementation as well encouraging and ensuring the project milestones. We also wish to express our gratitude to Mrs. Molly Furtado, Mrs. Sunita and Ms. Anama for supporting us by defining the clear process and guiding us. Their attitude towards the process development and helped our developers to understand the complex modules and develop the modules. Special kudos to Mrs. Molly Furtado as she is the most effective user of the implemented PMS system. Finally, we also wish to express our gratitude to all the project coordinators. They have cooperated amazingly well and are the sure reason for today's achievement. Thanks again to all who helped us to reach this milestone as well all who gathered here. Expecting the continued support as usual to fuel us to serve you better. Thank you.